guys welcome to another video so in this video I'm going to be showing you how to achieve a simple makeup look for everyday work or everyday uni or college I um, mean the last video I've gotten a couple of those comments and for the longest time you guys have been wanting me to do a makeup tutorial I've been kind of reluctant to do that because I'm not a beauty guru and there's loads of youtubers who do absolutely fabulous makeup but I've decided to do this because you guys know that I've recently started work and I have to be at work really really early and I've kind of gotten myself used to doing a very quick makeup now the truth of the matter is I don't wear makeup to work every day because I would much rather prefer to get longer sleep and rush out the door but the days that I wear makeup I realistically cannot sit down in front of the mirror for one hour doing all the contouring and under eye concealer and and whatnot so I have devised a very quick method of doing my makeup and yet looking simple and glamorous to work and literally guys I'm not kidding it takes me 15 to 20 minutes to get my face this way so if you want to see how I achieved this look keep watching guys and I hope you enjoy it I always start off with my eyebrows When I'm done applying that, I usually would just blend that in with a brow brush. And then I clean it up with a concealer. Now that I'm done with my eyebrows, the next thing I use is an eyeshadow primer and I use this whether or not I use an eyeshadow. The reason why is that during the course of the day, I notice that there's a crease, like a sweat crease or something. So this prevents my eyelids from creasing and I use this whether or not I use an eyeshadow. The reason why I like the Urban Decay one in particular is because it's clear. So you can't even really tell that I've just applied that on my eye. Some days I wear an eyeshadow, some days I don't, but for the purpose of this video, I am gonna apply an eyeshadow. To keep my makeup simple, usually I use only one, so I'm gonna be using Swiss chocolate. That's done, not so dramatic, but I think you can tell that I'm wearing an eyeshadow. Next on my list is my eyeliner. So what I'll normally do to get like a winged eyeliner, I'm not perfect in this, but um, I just hold my eyelid in a winged way, if that makes any sense. So the next thing that I would use is a mascara and normally I would only apply my eyeliner and my mascara to my top eyelashes. I don't apply anything to my bottom one until after I've put on my foundation. So next on my list is my foundation. Make sure that you've moisturized your face before applying this. So now that I'm done with my foundation, I'm going to apply eyeliner and mascara to my bottom lid. As you saw, I usually wouldn't touch my face to apply the eyeliner just so that I don't mess up my foundation, but I think it takes months of practice, so try not to poke your eye. Next thing is my powder. The last thing on my list for this simple makeup look is a clear lip gloss. I'm using one from Victoria's Secret. Lit 
literally doesn't have to take you more than 15 to 20 minutes to get yourself looking glamorous for work okay as you saw in this tutorial i didn't put any other contour in or the under eye concealer i would usually save that for a proper night out but i think this really suits my very fast-paced work life and if there's anyone out there who's working and struggling to get up hours in advance to do makeup you can definitely get yourself a simple and gorgeous makeup look before I go, I thought because this is a short video, I'm going to throw in a couple of Q&As. So I'm going to read off a few questions that I've gotten on my Ask FM. If you didn't know, I do have Ask FM and you can send me questions there. What is the first thing you do after waking up? I motivate myself so that I can get on with the day. Adana, what camera do you use for vlogging? Well, I don't vlog, I vlog, and the camera that I use for vlogging is the Canon EOS 70D, which my mother bought me as a graduation present. Thanks, mom. What medical school entry test did you take and how long did it take you to study? I didn't have any med school entry test because I had graduated from a university in England before applying to med school. And usually as a grad student, I don't think you take any tests. Well, for the school I went to anyway, you don't take any tests. Do you have any piercings? I do, I do, I do. I have the, the normal two piercings and then I have two more on each ear. So I have three piercings on my left, three piercings on my right. Then I have the, the tragus piercing. Then I have the, I had the one, the one that goes across your ear. I don't remember what that's called. And then I have two more up here. Guys, listen, I had loads of piercings, but the truth of the matter is I actually don't wear anything because when I had a baby, most of you don't know this, I ended up with a C-section. So to be rushed to theater, you need to take off every metal or item of piercing. And I took them off and after having Kian, I just couldn't be bothered to wear them again. But I'm thinking about going back to all my piercings. What are you doing today? Well, today I am filming this video. Are you single? <laughs> Do I really need to answer this, guys? No, I am not single. What year were you born? What year were you born? Are you trying to find out how old I am? No, I'm not gonna tell you. Hi, Adana, could you leave your email address below? I need to reach you. My email address, guys, is in my Instagram bio. So if you're not following me on Instagram, follow me on Instagram and you can get my email address. So the last question that I'm gonna, well, it's not really a question, but the last one that I'm gonna read is more of a compliment. That's why I'm blushing. Someone said, Adana, I think you're absolutely wonderful and Kian is super cute. Keep smiling and David is going to be the best dad. Thank you so much. I love you guys and I appreciate that all of you take the time out of your day to watch my videos. Thank you so much. I'm really, really grateful. I hope you enjoyed watching guys. Give it a thumbs up if you did. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.